All right, guys, the hatch is finally here at my brother's house. You can see. Time to get to work and waste no time. Let's get to it. She rolling. Yeah, you guys can see the engine bay. Needs a lot of work. The engine bay needs a lot of work. As you guys can see, all these small holes right here. All these holes right here. Need to get covered. Yeah, all these needs a lot of work. It's gonna look nice. It's gonna be it's gonna be a lot to do, but the end result will be worth it. I'm gonna weld all these holes up right here. Get it ready for the for the mount, for the K series mount. Yeah. Let's get it. Alright guys, I got some uh, dry ice here. You can pick this up uh, pretty much any market, pretty much any store, any uh, food store. Uh, we're going to need it for this, for the sound denny. You'll see right now how it works. So we're going to remove all this. This comes like this from a uh, factory. They do it mainly for sound, keep the sound low. Vibration and stuff like that, it goes under the carpet. There's no way of uh, removing it with like a flathead or anything. So we'll use this, you'll see how it works, it's magic. And get the get the inside all cleaned up. Get it all clean and ready for paint, ready for spray. This out. See that. side as well. I'm gonna throw some over there. Get, get these cables out of the way. Dry ice. It's crazy what stuff does. Damn. Try to keep it on that square right there while the sound is at. Throw some over here. Spread it out. Let it do its magic. Get out of here cracking. Get out of here cracking. It's already working. It's already working. I know I should have got more of this. I just got one block of it. Hopefully, hopefully it goes through. I'm just trying to spread it out as much as possible. Trying to spread it out as much as possible. Trying to remove this. So pretty much, it's gonna look pretty much just a bare shell. We're gonna remove all this. Gonna spread it out. Nice. In the meantime, while that shit, uh, while the dry ice is uh, doing its its work, I'm gonna go ahead and take off the fenders and stuff. I'm gonna take off the headlight, make it easier. Um, and fenders are good. I don't want to damage them with all the sanding and stuff. So, yeah, let's get to it. Got the fenders removed, both sides, headlights as well. Makes it much easier. Uh, this side's all dirty. Gonna go ahead and hit it with some, uh, later on with some uh, 3M uh, rubberized coating. Undercoat. Yeah, see how the dry ice is coming along. It's going, it's doing its magic. Some parts that I need to eat. Let's 
kind of hard recording and when you get the point, you see right here, some parts, I mean, it's not going to get it all, but the majority of it will. Oh yeah, it'll, the finish will be like this, bare metal, all oh, this will get painted, so let's keep going. On the driver's side now, passenger side is pretty much done. Just gotta go ahead and vacuum it, all whatever's left. Note that you will have to use a scraper or some. For some reason, this one's pretty stuck on pretty well. I don't expect to just lay the dry ice and it's gonna just peel off, you know. No, you gotta scrape some of it off, you know. Other than that, it's pretty much pretty simple. Alright guys, got most of it off, still a little bit left, but I'll probably get it when, once we prep it for paint. Other than that, it's pretty much ready, it's all metal to metal now. Went ahead and used that dry ice, let it sit for a while, and then I use uh, the hammer to pretty much break it, and then use a nice vacuum, scraper. Pretty much it. Alright guys, got the car on some vehicle dollies. Makes it much easier for us to move it around. Vehicle dollies, you can find these at Harbor Freight. Pretty cheap. I mean, for what we'll be doing, we're gonna move it around a lot. Yeah, see how easy it is, check it out. Pretty much sums up today's video guys, uh, went over what we need to do with my brother, kind of gave me a blueprint what we needed, uh, other than that I just need to be prepped and ready for paint, the inside is pretty much done too, just gotta scuff a few things, same with the engine bay, gonna hit it with some scuff pads, and hit it with some paint, fix up a few things that it needs, like right here, grind all that down. Went ahead and moved the car with the car dollies. And try to keep you guys posted as much as possible. Thank you guys for watching. Stay posted with for the next video, guys.